Hey guys, welcome back to Two Cents Beat. My name is Sadie and I am back with more Buddy Daddies. So last time we had a super cute, super wholesome uh, field day episode where Kazuki Papa and Ray Papa both cheered their hardest for Meaty in all of the events. And it was super cute and super wholesome. And that was it. That was the entirety of the episode. There was no after credit scene that completely painted all of what happened earlier in like this dark fog or like this 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 darkness this foreboding darkness no nothing like that no 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 it was all just really wholesome we have nothing to worry about because we have nothing to worry about how about we just jump on into this next episode and see what other happy-go-lucky times this happy family will have let's go Okay. <laughs> oh, it's their first time hearing Silent Night. That's cute. Oh my god, it's gonna sound terrifying. Once she starts singing. <laughs> Silent. <laughs> oh. Nobody's perfect. Bullbuddy's nerfic. Oh, she knows the song? Oh. Oh, is she gonna go into singing? Just like her mama? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, I think that's what she wanted. Oh, she pre-ordered it. <laughs> you pre-ordered it already? <gasps> Speaking of mama... Oh! How did she know? How did she find the daycare? Unless Kazuki Papa, like, told her, like, hey, this is where we're gonna be. I don't see that happening, no. I'm pretty sure he was like, okay, we gotta get this kid out of here. Hmm. Oh, but she's looking... Okay. She doesn't have bags under her eyes anymore. Oh. Hello. Yep, that was you. Wait, 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 you guys are doing this in front of her daycare. If you hadn't chucked her out. Yeah. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, I thought so. Because she doesn't know. She just thinks that she's just been living with her dad. Oh. Damn. Is this going to be a hard episode? This is going to be a hard episode. I hope they handle this well. Oh. Showing her all her drawings. <laughs> In front of me. <laughs> Wow, Ray Papa's being the sensible one? Is she gonna see, like, look? This is how well they're taking care of her? <sighs> That's so heartbreaking. Why are you putting- that, why are you posing that type of question to a child? <sighs> oh. <laughs> the one you buy from the store. It's literally just microwavable. Hey, <laughs> this is good. <laughs> oh my god. Mm, oh my god. Okay, they're probably gonna have a discussion. Oh? Oh? Wait, does she get like surgery or something? <laughs> Pay up! Yeah, they're gonna have a talk now that she's asleep. Oh. <gasps> oh, boy. I was about to say, I don't think that's gonna work on them. So... So you want to... <sighs> so she wants to, like, take me... No, no, this is my, like... <sighs> finding it so difficult to try and relate to try and sympathize with her but because it sounds like now that she's realized now that she's aware that she has a time limit it's like now she wants to take meaty away from something that's good for her because she's wants time with meaty and i'm sure obviously meaty wants time with her too which uh, but still it's like 
Damn. Okay, I didn't think they were going to throw in a time limit like this. I kind of wish they hadn't. Because it ups the stakes more, but it, it makes it... I mean, what what can you do, right? I guess. I feel like that's what they're going to say. Like, what can, what can we do? We can't do anything. <sighs> a fresh start. And sometimes that is what it takes for you to realize. Mm -hmm. That is true. But she's saying she'll do whatever, not that she can do it. Yeah, I was about to say. Mm -hmm. She's gonna ask her. <gasps> she's just gonna put her foot down. Oh, <gasps> she's gonna blackmail them. This. What? You must agree. Oh, okay. No, pity goes out the window at that point. How? <sighs> like seriously? They are doing a better job of taking care of Meaty than she has been doing, had been doing before she changed. So how dare her? Like, they are in the same, pretty much, like, although their line of work is dangerous, it's not like they're mistreating her or feeding her, like, microwavable food only or, like, abandoning her or anything. So it's like, they're already doing better than she did before she was before she quote changed so and so for her to throw that in their faces it's like <sighs> just because she's not getting what she wants it's like how dare you ma'am seriously how dare you ma'am damn I can't believe the series is actually throwing something like that. Was it staged? Tell me this was like planned out by Ray Papa's family. She said, <laughs> oh, so Meanie's mad. For real? <gasps> Cute! Oh, it has? They haven't even been focusing on their, their other lives. To save her and them. Oh. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. And of course, he has first hand experience at what can happen or what will happen if he betrays the organization. Literally, like a, a month ago. Fudge. Man. No, it's not. Ooh, that is true. But it's not like he was that much of a father anyway. Father is not blood relation. Not only, I guess, blood relations. Oh. What is it, an amusement park? Disneyland? Oh, it's a mall. Like a, it, it's like a <laughs> It's got this and this. <laughs> oh, it was cute. Oh, oh my God. Oh, she's perfectly safe. Call the Motosan. But what if it's oh always, always the worry word. Wow, hello. <laughs> then puts on the helmet. <laughs> wow! <laughs> like a spider! Oh, Kazuki can't do it. It's only like a foot up. <laughs> Wait, I kind of... <laughs> Hold up. I want to... I want to see it again. That was cool. Right, Papa was cool. <laughs> You at six. <gasps> Do not tell me they're gonna like hand her off right now. Don't tell me. 
Crepe? I'm gonna give her a bite. Give him a bite. Oh, oh he goes. <laughs> Can't say no. <laughs> I like how she holds the, the spoon. Oh. <laughs> wow, they're showing a lot of like them taking care of me. <gasps> Oh, that heart. My heart. I mean, my heart hurt. Just co-parent or something. No, just kidding. Oh, don't cry. You're going to make me cry now. <laughs> Why are you making me cry? <sighs> oh, my God. Don't cry, don't cry, don't cry, don't cry. <sighs> of course, they had the moms right in frame and everything. <sighs> about her father? I don't know about that. Mm -mm. I think she's still too young to understand. Mm -hmm. No sad thoughts. You'll have plenty of time for sad thoughts potentially later i've been on a ferris wheel once a really big one never again no oh it's starting to get christmas time oh oh is that really what he said Mm. If you can't see it through, yeah. Yeah. Oh? For her. For her. <laughs> ah! No! Oh, my goodness. Oh, God, me too. I can't see. My tears are blurring my eyes. Oh. Oh, go away, go away. Go away, go away, go away. That was sad. Oh. Right at the climax and they start going down. <laughs> Time to wake up from the dream. Uh, why am I always taken taken by surprise with these episodes, guys? I had a feeling, but it was also like, no, maybe they'll like maybe they'll save it for next time or whatever. But alas, here we are. They're not even gonna tell. Is this the last time they're gonna see her? Like, are they not even going to tell her? Oh. Oh, the scarf. His scarf. Oh. <laughs> ah. See you tomorrow. Will he? <sighs> Will she? It's ending. That's what they're going to end us on. What is this ending? No! 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 Oh my god. My head. Okay, wow. Uh, I was not expecting um, this. I was kind of hoping we would get like one more wholesome, sweet, fun episode light-hearted episode before everything hit the fan but nope i mean i guess technically it isn't like the worst case scenario which would be like what kazuki papa has already experienced before but this really sucks this sucks i don't like this
but on the same notion, like realistically, yeah, this feels very like for what this series is, this feels like a very realistic take on their current situation. The whole like, you know, the whole bit about like the mom having like a time crunch feels like it could have it was a little contrived to help like to help garner sympathy for her but like the fact that they are assassins and that their line of work puts Meaty in danger and that at some point you know Meaty would be in trouble blah 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 and they would probably have to part ways it's like yeah yeah (sighs) I cried so much this episode this was so sad uh I didn't want the happy times to end and now here we are But also, we have three more episodes left. Maybe this could turn around. Maybe. Like, maybe this would be, like, the perfect time for them to escape the organization's claws, you know, change the undesirable aspect, quote, undesirable aspect, about themselves or the unstable aspect of their lives, which is their jobs. Kind of like what meaty's mom did and then be like hey now what's your excuse and then they can take meaty back right because i mean it's called buddy daddies they need somebody to daddy obviously (laughs) they need meaty to be daddies and they can't be childless for three episodes can they i guess they could but no 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 so like Taking a step back from it, it's like, I think I could see where the story is going, maybe? If they're trying to, like, wrap this up. I mean, this is an original series, so they should probably try and wrap this up within this arc, or within this season, right? So, maybe that's what they're trying for? Like, as much as it sucks to see Meaty be taken away from our papas... It's like, if the mom really has changed and really is, like, well, like, ready to take care of Meaty, then this isn't a bad thing. It's not like this is a bad thing. However, though, she did keep mentioning, like, things from her perspective. Or she did keep putting things in her, in her general state, like, She was being very self-centered with the way she was, like, describing or explaining things, which makes me question, like, um, her reasonings for things. But that could have just been, like, to give them drama and stuff, so I don't know. I'm not sure about that. But if she is ready, then, I mean, yeah, she messed up, but people change. People deserve second chances. So... (sighs) Yeah. I don't know. I I don't know how they're gonna... I have some ideas, but I'm not sure how they're gonna develop this story or the rest of the story. Like, yeah, I don't know. I... I don't know. Let me know what you guys think of this episode in the comments down below and what you think they're gonna do with the rest of this story. Because I can see it going a couple different ways, but it's gonna depend on the next episode. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe if you liked this video. Check out Patreon for early access and longer episode reactions. Check out the socials, more anime and manga content. Don't forget to drink some water, and I hope to catch you guys in the next one. Bye!